dude. Walmart app is so fucking stupid. It's saying that all of these things are out of stock or low stock. Does that look out of stock or low stock to you? There's a shitload of them. Like, they have every one of them. They have so many of these strainers. 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 You don't have the nerve to tell me that all of the strainers are out of stock or low stock. You're bullshitting around. That's why I don't even listen to the, I don't even take the stupid app serious. Because every time I'll look up my store to make sure they have what I want so I'm not wasting my time, it'll say this out of stock. And I'll go to that store and then it has a million of them in there. Like, do they just not update the app anymore? It's so stupid. It's the lotion that I will put in motion. Which one to get? There's too much. Well, that was a delightful breakfast. I'm gonna go home. When you take a picture, it'll last longer. Oh. Gotta go take yet another shower. Every damn time I go outside, I have to take a fucking shower. This damn humidity makes me sweat my nutsack off. She's courteous. Fucking car sounds like a go kart. Ford Taurus sounds like a fucking truck. I gotta be fat. Why is everyone fat? Fat! Now I'm getting fat! Such a fatty... I got a gut! My childhood friend from the second grade is coming on to me! Why didn't he tell me he was gay years ago? I don't want to be friends with someone who's secretly fantasizing about my dick in their butt! So weird. I love this bridge, folks.
God damn it. Where do you get a job in the middle of the tropical woods? Passing, but it's like straight up abandoned. People are just so controlling and possessive over stuff that they're not even gonna use. It's like, that's land. I'm gonna own that land and I'm not gonna do anything with it. I'm just gonna let everything sit there and rot. There should be a law that states that even if you own land, you can't have abandoned garbage on it. You gotta do something. You got It's gotta be like the HOA. You can't have like abandoned shit, abandoned buildings. You gotta take care of your land. It's gotta be a law. There's still so much abandoned shit over here, but it's still private property because some stupid bitch owns it. They're not gonna do anything with it. So it makes the whole town look like shit because there's so many places where people own the land, but they don't do anything with it. This doesn't make any sense. Why do you want to own something that you're not going to do anything with? Like, is that person dead or something? How can you call something private property that's abandoned? Can't even pull the weeds. Duh. Duh. I want a waffle sandwich. Still need to find a new tripod so I don't have to keep screwing with it every time I make a turn or go over a bump. I'll find it eventually. I will find it eventually, folks. Stupid red lights. Stupid red lights gotta cater to one car. You couldn't have stayed green for one more second. I always have the same problem with all these stupid red lights. They couldn't stay green for literally one more second. Stupid troll. There's cameras on the red lights. I just have a feeling that someone's watching them and they're like, hey, there's some cars coming. Let's just turn it red on purpose to cause a fucking traffic jam. I feel like sometimes some people are like watching these cameras in real time and they just keep mashing on the buttons that change it from green to red. And they do that on purpose to fuck with people. But then again, I also know, obviously, that it's sensors. Whenever a car drives over the sensors in the road or it senses a car there, it changes it from red to green. I get that. I'm just being retarded. from you know who or maybe I won't hear anything I really don't care anymore I'm too focused on trying to get a fucking job that's really the only thing I want to deal with now is get a damn job fart that job interview was the biggest waste of time ever it was just like getting me all piped up for nothing because I had a job interview. I was supposed to go there on Wednesday and then they're like, oh, we're going to reschedule for Thursday. 
And then when I got there and found out that this was bullshit, like I didn't even, this was something that I was not gonna do. That's why I was asking them beforehand, before I even got there, what exactly am I doing at this dumb job? But they just rescheduled it. And then when I got there, I got there at the time that I was supposed to be there and then they're gonna reschedule it again and be like, whoa, you gotta wait. They, they gotta reschedule it for like 40 minutes before we can actually do it. I'm like, are you fucking serious? I smell weed. But then it's like the second I step foot into here, it was like, it was a bar. And I'm like, what the fuck am I doing here? I'm not working at a bar. So for obvious reasons, I'm not gonna work at a fucking bar. It's like the whole name of the bar it, I thought the name of the bar was the security company. Like, the name of the bar just sounded like a fucking security company. So I thought it was going to be an office to just do a typical interview in. But no, it was a fucking bar. That was the name of the bar. So not only are they flaky as shit, they rescheduled twice in a day. But to make it worse, they wouldn't even tell me what the fuck the job was until I already got there. So they're just constantly wasting my time. So I just left and the job search continues. I'm just gonna keep looking for a job until I find someone who's not brain dead. Someone who's gonna like actually give me a job because here I am like actually serious about getting a fucking job and nobody else seems to be serious they're just treating me like a fucking joke or something like I want a damn job I'm not fucking around that's all these people do is fuck around I'm not trying to fucking waste my time stupid bitch go wasting my time I'm looking for a job I'm not looking for bullshit if I wanted bullshit I'd go to a farm and pick up a sack of shit and eat it. Or take a picture of it and convert it into a fucking poop emoji. I'm not looking for bullshit, I'm looking for a job, you stupid asshole. Quit treating me like a joke. I'm gonna treat you like a bitch. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this very pleasant video. This very busy delicious video if I get one more f fuck you Letting you know that the warranty on your vehicle has expired. Fuck you! Call for you to renew. Fuck you, you, fuck you, fuck you! So would you like to hear your options about getting back under coverage? Is this a human being or a fucking robot? Silence! Would you like to hear your options about getting back under coverage? Is this a robot or a person? Sorry for the inconvenience. We will make sure to put you on the do not call list. Bitch! Do not call list! Full of shit! I get like 10 fucking spam calls a day from different numbers. Do not call list! You're full of shit! Let's read my recent text. No, you've known me since second grade. Sorry to disappoint you, but I'm straight. Why are you gay? Do you have any more job interviews this week, by the way? Are you busy or something? I'm gonna call this motherfucker. Hello? Why are you gay? No, I'm not, I swear. You should have told me this like 15 years ago. Why don't you tell me you were gay like in the second grade? Because I'm not. What has the Biden administration got to you? No. I don't want to be friends with someone who's secretly fantasizing about my dick in their butthole. <laughs> you went on a rant, so I guess the job interview didn't go well. <laughs> I. The name of the company sounded like a security company. I didn't know it was a bar.
That is a high risk zone. I'm not working at a bar. It's a high risk zone. You're not working at a bar. Yeah, that makes sense because a lot of people, alcohol suppresses your immune system. So even if they don't come there with COVID, they can easily catch it there. I might as well be drunk because I already have a messed up immune system. Yeah, I started sipping 4th of July vodka. Have you seen the Smirnoff bottle that's like red, white, and blue? I see those all the time, but they don't have them in grocery stores. I have to make a separate trip to a liquor store. Well, that's the spirit. That's where the, that's where the spirit is, man. The liquor store. It's usually cheaper at the grocery I store. I bought one for like eight bucks, dude, and it actually isn't. It tastes like one of those red, white, and blue popsicles. Like, you can straight up drink it without a chaser. I just want out and do it, though. This is going to be a whole separate video. Go look for it.